Welcome back, guys. Hope you are having a great day so far, or uh, the end of one. I, 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 you know, I didn't, I didn't show you the percentages. Fifty-seven is our lowest. We got like four people with it. We haven't, we haven't shot people with magical guns in a while, so might as well, right? It's been, it's been a minute, so. Juro, are you sleeping? Uh, Yakushiji. Sorry, did I wake you? What do you think? Like what? <laughs> that dream. The woman at Sumire Bridge. It was Fuyusaka-san. What? Oh no. You heard me? Wait, you said it was right Fuyu there. What do you mean? Class, right? This has nothing to do with you. <sighs> Was he dreaming or remembering? And why about her? What a nice evening. Fluffy. Oh. Sorry about that. Uh, you know, a little, little, little person just revving their fucking engine down the road. Classic, really. Um, interesting. Let's start with Hisaragi, actually. I shot Tomi. Okay, that was the Yeah, I remember this. She was in the crowd. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Looks like you had it in you after all. A deal's a deal. I'll poke inside Juro's head for you. What does Juro's dream mean? What the fuck is he what supposed to know? About? The one about Iori Fuyusaka. Why is he dreaming about her? He's a cat! How is he gonna know? Don't ask me. I had nothing to do with it. Seems like he dreamt it on his own. Oh. <laughs> He is a boy, oh. and right at that special age. No surprise he dreams about the girl he's into. Bro. That's not true. <laughs> Could that really be true? <laughs> Does Juro have feelings for that girl? <laughs> you know what that means. You're in the past now, right? Well, maybe this Juro... I'm sorry, I just absolutely love, like, how dare you say that? That's not true. Turns around, but what if it is true? What if, what if, what if it was true? <laughs> Enough. How about I give you an order that'll change that? Uh, what? Yori Fuyusaka's a witch. Oh, we're not gonna use the magical so gun on her. Indeed, time to shoot and drag her onto the battlefield. Fluffy. Why do you get the fuck out of here? You doing? You're gonna blow my cover, you damn cat. Yeah, that's what I thought. Get the hell out of here. What? Can't chase him? What are you doing, brother? Oh fuck! I gotta be a little. Is this your idea of a joke? Come back here. Oh, he just actually vanished into thin air. Well, okay. Um, you know, it's interesting. Yakushiji hasn't had, ya, ya, blah, 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 Yakushiji hasn't had literally any options ever. Everything's been just straight along the path here. Kind of, kind of bizarre, especially compared to someone like Shinonome. Wait, how did you get here? Are you trying to mess with me? Oh, uh, what? What's up with you? Is this about the other nine? Interesting. He doesn't know about the other no, cats. That has nothing to do with it. Huh. I knew you were being annoying. Mm. Uh, maybe I need a break. What? <laughs> Poor Miwako. <laughs> Just like, oh, there she goes, talking to that cat. Oh, You'll God. You'll feel better after you shoot Fuyusaka. <laughs> You know you want to. <laughs> I'm only doing it because she's a witch. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Don't this lie to yourself. This is flattering. But lying about it is just sad. Very true. <laughs> Put my angry eyebrows on now. <laughs> Answer high school, but I'm, I'm not happy about it. <laughs> Poor... 
poor Megami, man. She just kind of gets shit on in her entire story by a fucking cat. She said she wasn't interested. Oh god, here we go. Totally seemed like she was. So, yeah, there's that. Come on, Miwa-chan. You're always looking for romance. You said the same thing about me and Kurabi kun Oh fuck! <laughs> she gets angry about it. <laughs> I'm definitely right this time. Usami-chan, really? I just don't see it. We were just talking about Nanji kun You remember, right? She said she wasn't interested. Okay, and then it loops. Got so it. You suck totally seem like she was. Do you have a second? Hmm. Oh, you're in Nachan's class, right? Yes, I'm Yakushiji. Could I talk to you? Just the two of us? Huh? Well, sure. I don't mind. How about on the roof? Is that okay? We're going back to the roof again? Right, this ended horribly. So, what is it? Oh, it's a little hard to talk about here. Okay, well... Is the roof to the right? I'm actually not sure. I, I'm gonna walk with authority. <laughs> uh, hey, don't worry about is him. He looking for me? This isn't good. Just, just like, slip on past, you know? He'll never, he'll never know. Oh, oh fuck, he, he noticed. Hey, Fuyasaka. Who's that? Yakushiji san. She's from 1C. <laughs> Why is she so right? far in the foreground? Can't let that happen. Actually, not the roof. Let's go that way. Hmm? <laughs> Poor Iori. She's like, oh, okay, I guess. Like, what? What are we gonna do now? Miwako just stands there. Do you have not have anywhere to be or anything to do? Like, you're just gonna stand in the hall and wait. Oh God. You're gonna shoot her in the bathroom? That's super fucked up. So, what did you want to talk about? <laughs> Stay away Juro from Juro. Yeah, Juro is mine. Yeah. How dare you try to take him away from me? <laughs> no, that's not why I'm doing this. Bro, just do it. It'll be fine, this and then you shoot her. For him. Um. Just fucking blast! Stop! Stop with all this nonsense here. This is for Juro. Kurabe kun but. Is it really? Who is this for? No, you're doing this for you, because you want him to love you again. We all know it. Blaster, don't think about it, just do it. This is for me. Yakushiji san? Even so. <laughs> it's pretty fucked up, dude. Uh, hey, um. Are you okay? Huh? Miwa-chan? She, she slipped and fell. It was weird. Why am I... How did I get here? Well, I'll just leave. Don't, don't mind me. Uh-oh. Uh... What did you do to Yuri-chan? She slipped and fell! It, it happens! M miwa -chan. Why's it gotta be me, this you know? Been acting strange, Yuri -chan. I mean, that's, that's fair. I saw her just this morning in front of the school. She was talking to the gate like it could talk back or something. Oh, they can't. The cat's not real. To the gate? You mean you couldn't see Fluffy? Oh my god. She even named it. <laughs> Bro, every. No one's real. All right. That's what we're learning is that no one is fucking real. Everyone, anyone ever talks to is actually just a figment of their imagination. I'm, I, I beg your pardon. Complete Juro Karabe's Juro Karabe event. <laughs> uh, it's got to be like one of these, right? Surely. I mean, we're kind of getting pretty far with him. But anyway, we got we got other people. Let's jump back into Sekigahara's story. Let's see what he's up to. Honestly, I don't 
fully remember what the fuck the last thing we did with him was. Uh, so give me a little sec here. Um, encounter. Okay, after he, he's chasing Megami, encounters Miura. And then, yeah, he rem Okay, I remember now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where he's talking to the, the AI version, right? He's like, I gotta upgrade the Sentinels. Okay. So we've got Phaser and Cryptic Note that we can look at. Oh, that's the, that's the wrong button. A girl with red DD4. We're just gonna... Eventually, we'll find the new ones. Oh, God. Uh, let's just go top to bottom. Ryoko Shinonome. Let's see. Attempting to delay nanomachine separation in the brain. Applying memory link enhancement. C0204 and C22. So there are two types of pills then. C0204 is the same one I have. It's been over a week since she last received a dose. I wonder how she's doing. Uh, not great. Pills. Her memory must also be suffering. I can also, I can tell you with authority, she's not doing well. Shu are Amiguchi. these, these are new, okay. He was administered NMA8076. So they are be being given Looks different like medication. Different kind of nanomachine medication. Seems it was only administered once. All it says is 20% transplant rate. Got it, okay. So I think, I think what's happening to Amaguchi is they're trying to put Ida's memories into Amaguchi, maybe? That's my best guess currently. Oh, here we Juro fucking go. Izumi. Here we go. He's receiving two types of treatment. NMA8075 and B01. A075 is received is, huh. four doses of A8075. Then switch to B01 from the fifth dose on. And there's a scribbled note here. B01 was synthesized by Tamao Kurabe. Huh. Interesting. So why? Hmm. Because I, you know, the, the whole, the whole. Sorry, I just had to think about this for a moment. The whole, the whole, you know, story we've been fed, right? Is that Juro and and Ryoko, right? They fought in their robots too long. It fucked up their personality. It, you know, brain go bad. They gotta fix it, right? That seems to be what they're doing with Ryoko, right? Like her nano machines are fucking separating, whatever the hell that means. It sounds terrifying, right? And they're trying to piece it back together. I imagine. I don't. I don't know. Establish memory link, right? It sounds like they're trying to fix Shinonome. Juro is is uh, Amaguchi is on something completely different, right? He he. Uh, if my current, you know, idea is right. If my current my current fucking theory, hypothesis, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Um, guess, honestly, uh, is that they're trying to take Amaguchi, who was his own guy, and put Ida, like, overwrite Amaguchi with Ida. But Juro's getting the same treatment as Amaguchi was, right? He's not getting the fixing treatment that Ryoko was. So I don't, hmm. And my thought was that maybe Juro Izumi was some, like, important guy that they're trying to then put... No, but they're they're changing him to Juro Karabe, right? Izumi, I don't think is a good guy. Like everything Juro Izumi has has done that we've seen has been very villainous looking. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I got I got to think on that, brother. She seems. That student I saw in front of the school gate. She's not Tsunomi Nami. She's likely already gone home by now. I'll have to wait until tomorrow morning. These numbers are for the message service. Oh yeah, we learned about that One as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Number, and the other is the password. There's an emblem on it. Maybe it's a car key? A gun from the underground facility in the future. The android was using it. Why does this guy keep calling? Have I been following his orders this whole time? He wanted information, and he was trying to extract it from that data unit. <sighs> hmm. <sighs> oh, just an ordinary cop. Gre greetings, officer. How are you doing? Do you do you want something? <laughs> 
<laughs> Would you like this gun, officer? Now that I think about it, this is the same gun that android was using. The one from the future. Hey, you! Uh... What were you just holding? Show me right now. Yeah, this may have been a bad idea, huh? Um... Well, I guess we're going down phaser path. I wanted to go down cryptic note, but here we go. Now do what I say and empty your pockets. Uh, I want a toy gun. I'm taking you in for further questioning. Yeah. Oh, he just snatched Damn it back and then ran. <laughs> I'm out of here. We're like a literal fugitive from the law. Okay, well. Well, you ran like back to, to the scene cop. of the crime? Come on, what are you doing, dude? Oh my God. All that running, and I end up back here. Well, someone Morning cleaned Morrow's it up, death hasn't looks been like. Public yet. Those black suits must have disposed of the body. Okay, let's say I did kill her. At that point, they were already coming after me. Did I lure Morimura out here? It just doesn't add up. I managed to find some good clues here before, but I'm still not sure what some of them mean. <laughs> Honestly, I'm not sure what most of them mean, truth be told. An outdated transceiver. This key I had on me. It has some kind of emblem on it. Was I driving a car? What's the emblem look like? <sighs> the emblem appears to be a button. Ooh, okay. You push the button. Mm. Well, I pressed it. No nearby car made a sound, though. Maybe it's somewhere further away. These numbers are for the message service. One set is the user number, and the other is the password. Hmm. Well, I mean, oh, okay. Um, what? <laughs> I beg your pardon? How the hell did we smuggle this here? What the hell? How in the world did this motorcycle get here? The auto driving motorcycle. Press the button on the key. I must have. Voice authentication. Verify. Yo, that thing is cool as hell. Key Wait a minute. To unlock this vehicle. It's voice activated too. Is this a self-driving motorcycle? Can he, can he talk to it? Knight Rider, is that you? How you doing, dude? You may issue commands using your voice. That's pretty cool. Please set your next destination. I don't know where the fuck I want to go. Hey, who do you belong to? <laughs> Registered drivers of the Shikishima SXRNR. Of course, it's Shikishima. And Chihiro Morimura. And Morimura. Me? Huh. And Morimura? It looks like I've used this motorcycle before. Then it must know where I've taken it. I'm guessing you have a travel log, right? Can you pull it up? Displaying travel log. <sighs> Looks like I've taken this thing all around the city. But there are only two places I've visited multiple times. Aside from Sakura High, it's just this one other spot. Let's go there. Set this location as your destination? Yes. Oh, let's, let's go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's roll out. <laughs> Bro, everyone's got bikes in this game, man. Amaguchi has one. Now Sekigahara has one. That's why he has the motorcyclist hey, skill. I thought it was weird. Oh, it I makes sense. Leave anything with you? Invalid request. Please specify. I want to know if I left behind any messages. Two logs found from A. Sekigahara. Seriously? Begin playback? Yeah. Show me. So, did you find it? My. Wow. Your intuition was right. What was it? I'm leaving this message as a precaution. Just in case I lose my memory sooner than I expect. You've still got work to do if you want to escape this world. 
must acquire the data logs from 2188. One more thing, and this takes priority over all else. You can't let Chihiro Morimura execute Operation Aegis. She holds a position as a nurse at Sakura High School. But it's all under false pretenses. Stop her at all costs. My headaches are getting worse. I'm running out of time. In any case, some interesting developments have come up. I've confirmed that Iori Fuyusaka was able to use the gate. I checked the log she left behind. The ID she used was Mori Murat's. Was Mori Murat's yeah. biometric ID. I, we, we knew that, right? She's got to be like a clone. Is Chihiro Mori Murat. Knowing this, do I still try to stop Operation Aegis? That's the real question. Well, the answer's obvious, isn't it? Playback complete. <sighs> Fuyusaka is Morimura? How is that possible? And what did I decide to do? This is where Okino so this is. is. The place. Now what am I gonna find here? That's a really fucking good question, isn't it? What are we gonna find up here? Locked. It is, kick it open. This Shoot it open. Has to be what I'm here I don't for. know, whatever. Break the window. It's a glass window up there. Just hop in. Or through this one. This one's even easier. Anyone leave like a key around? Oh, Hey, you, let me in there. I want to go in there. What's up? Well, look who we have here. Sekigahara. You know me? Here Wait a minute. Some more trouble? <sighs> Something wrong? No, nothing. Uh, let me guess. You finally lost your memories, right? So he knows. Intra because I'm wondering now, Sekigahara was found with that pill bottle, so was he also administered the fucking fuck up your head pills? Is that what was going on? How... How did you know? Just by the way you're acting. Kind of a dead giveaway. I'm surprised you even made it back here. Do you know what I was trying to do here? That's odd. Okay, no. You're in my way. Hey, hey! And you are? Oh, okay, um... Hey, don't look at my back, you weirdo. What are you doing? It didn't work. I suppose 32% wasn't enough. What? What did you do to me? You recognize me, don't you? No. No. I don't. I mean, I, the player, that do, but... Be. Hey, Focus. yo! Hey, Okino. Take a good look at my face. I know you can remember. What? Uh, see, never mind. Nah, I'm good. <laughs> what's up? What's up with his face? Wait. This can't be. This is in the forties. Or well, the location that I'm. I'm gonna still refer to. I. I am very solid in my current idea that like each individual timeline isn't a timeline it's its own location right so i'm still gonna refer to them as timelines though just because it's easier to do that right like it's easier to call this the 40s place right you know or just call it the 40s even though it's not actually the 40s right this is a third, a third gen generation right model. yeah sentinel number 19 so this is where it was transmitted is this a hangar for Sentinels? Awfully persistent, aren't you? Fine. You got me. Wait, hold on, hold on. What can I think about? It's basically the nano machine. We already know that. Pills the android gave me in the underground facility. Oh yeah, that's where he got those. I remember now. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. 426. 
don't think that's true. I think that they might have, you know, sped it up <laughs> or caused it you, even. Okino. Even in this outfit, you managed to catch me. Have you been in hiding ever since the incident? Just laying low in Sector 5? <sighs> Tell me, Sekigahara-kun. Oh, fuck. I had something I could talk about, but... searching for me? I didn't... I, I pressed X on accident. Okay, no, this goes here. I need to stop the effects of DD-426. You're an expert on the subject, aren't you? I am indeed. It's a code that was distributed on the battlefield. Do you know who's responsible for spreading it? Boy, I wish I did. God damn, no. dude, did I wish I did. Right. This is exactly why I went into hiding. Because I can't trust anyone. And that includes you, a Sekigahara. You were on the battlefield too. Yet you're not showing any symptoms. Pretty suspicious. I could say the same about you. Uh, uh, I'm taking pills to help reduce the symptoms. Pills? I don't I don't know about these pills, man. These. I see. These serve as additional code for priority processing. These aren't going to save me. Of course they won't. Okay, no, so the pills are All good. All you're doing is buying yourself some time. What about you? You're completely healthy. There must be some way to stop it, right? I'm afraid that's impossible. Then how come you're okay? It was about a year ago. I discovered a code created by 426. The aptly named DD-426. I tested it on myself in an attempt to detach the decode, <sighs> which resulted in the loss of my memories. Mm. That's why I was unaffected on the battlefield. That can't be true. You don't seem like you've lost your memories at all. That's because I transferred my memories to my nanomachines. And I was able to create a simulated personality. That? It carries all the qualities that make up my identity. That seems like a pretty smart way to get around this. How come more, how come more people aren't doing this? Hold on. Wait a minute. Let me get this straight. You're a program that's simulating Okino? Though I guess, yeah, like, technically this is true. You want to get into the fucking technicalities of it? I, whatever, right? I, I'm not I'm not going to go here and be like, oh, you're technically not Okino. You're just a bunch of nanomachines with Okino's memories. It's pretending, like, what? what's the difference? All right, I'll, I've been down this road in, in, like, three different games now, okay? Like, however, I suppose the reason they can't do that with everyone is because Okino knew that he was going to be infecting himself with this, right? And he, he made preparations accordingly and he knew what the risks were. So he was like, hey, if I lose my memories, I've got like, you know, a way to, 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 to deal with it, right? Nobody else had a clue. They were just like hit with it, you know? And once they're gone, they're gone, right? Initially, yes. But now that I've been affixed to the brain, I've become the true Tsukasa Okino. I possess the original Okino's personality and memory. Yeah, like honestly, good enough for me. You can't even tell the difference. But you're still not the same. But whatever. The Okino from before was different. Was he? Human beings are constantly evolving. Whether we retain our memories or not, we're never the same as our past selves. I agree with that. That's very true. My goodness. Your pursuit of me caused quite the panic. Professor Doji wants to have me restrained. And now that you've caught me, maybe it's time I gave up. Oh, perfect timing. Huh? Hijiyama-kun, over here! Oh my god, she Help! sicked fucking Takatoshi huh? on him! That's so, or he, technically. That's so fucked up. Oh no! <laughs> What's going on? This is fucked up. Th that man. Hey, who the hell are you? How'd you get in here? Please, make him go away. <laughs> Bro. Not so fast, you bastard. You're coming with me. This is highly classified material, and you've seen too much. Damn you, Okino. <laughs> they just run away. 
Hey, can you take like a step back now? Okay, no. Get out of my personal space, you freak. Jesus. Remember now? Sukasa Okino. We met in Sector 5. Good. And you're an AI construct. Huh? Kind of. Is that all? You've neglected to remember some rather important detail. What do you mean neglected to remember? Could it's not like he chooses. Oh, what is this? Okino, Stop this. This is weird. Really so close to him. Even Takatoshi's like, this is fucking weird. Don't pay him any mind. He's just jealous. That That is kind of true, though. That <sighs> yeah, right. He, he is jealous. Now, we all know you're jealous. Sekigahara. Try to remember why you kept coming back here. Did we get put into the fucking weird headband machine at some point as well? Oh, I want to look around here though. What's 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 in here? Okay, uh, honestly, not that much of interest. Truth be told, it's a pretty shitty hideout. How are you feeling? My head feels like it's about to split in half. Classic. What about the pills? They aren't working. But you've taken so many of them already. They still aren't helping. It's called building an immunity. I've <laughs> built an immunity to these code pills. <laughs> we're ready to go. Where, where the oh. fuck are we going? There was one thing I wanted to ask you. You seemed very reluctant to go through with this at first. But now you've come to rely on this plan. So what changed your mind? Nothing changed. I still think this is terrible. <laughs> but there are some things I don't want to forget. Like that vile face of yours. Whoa, hey, yo. I'll be sure to preserve that memory for you. Walk me through the steps once more. Sure. First, I'll input a memory extraction code into you. He did the same thing to, to Sekigahara. Saved at any time. Yeah, 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 yeah. Your consciousness itself, though, can't be saved. Then a simulated personality will. All I need is for you to save my memories. I don't want some AI taking over me. A simulated personality will think the same way you do. It'll be able to work together with your own brain. In other words, it will act as a support to your brain. The relationship is symbiotic. It'll teach your brain new ways to think and solve problems. But you will still be in charge of decision making. I just... I hate myself. Uh, what? I really don't need a simulated personality. <laughs> All right. In that case, I'll simply extract your memories. After your memories are extracted, they'll be stored in your nano machines. I'll configure it so when the decode region is detached, your memories will be backed up. We'll require an intracerebral map to save your memories, though it'll all be pointless if you end up as a husk. Your brain did have more damage than anticipated. My equipment can only do so much. I'll only be able to map roughly 30% of the region per scan. Damn. So you'll have to make multiple trips. That's why he kept coming back. Okay, makes sense. Let's get started, shall we? Please, take a seat. So can we, if you've extracted his memories, can we get them, can, 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 can you put them back? <laughs> Is that, I don't know how this works. Can you just like <laughs> slot I'm them back in there? <laughs> your intracerebral map. We'll start with some word exercises. Just hot swap it in like an SSD. Try listing any words starting with A that come to mind. As you say each word, imagine the object in your head. A. Apple. Asphalt. Anchor. I didn't get to see the objects though. What the hell, guy? Come on. Interesting. Oh, we got it. Okay, so we're locked here as well. Okay, all right. We're, we're starting to get somewhere, though. The 57 seemed to jump to 71. 
So we're we're making some some good progress here. Um, I still. Where do I get this key? I must have to go back in here to like get that keyword from one of these pads. Like I don't know where the fuck else I'm gonna get it, you know. However, we did a little, little destruction. It's been a minute, right? Right? Remember that? Remember that? Oh god, and it's a boss battle too. All right, put me in, brother. I'm ready. Okay, we need Goto. Goto must be on the strike team. Me. And I get three other dudes. Uh, also, I can't have anyone immobilized. This uh -oh. is gonna be tricky. Um, we need to bring the big guns here. Maximum four, one of which is Goto. Clear without a Sentinel being immobilized. Uh, my heart wants me to take Yuki because she has the ceramic plated armor, but I've learned that uh, it's not, you know, all it's cracked up to be as things become, like you can't just kind of throw Yuki in there and be like, she'll be fine. She won't be fine. Um, I think having a long range is very good. What type, what, what are we gonna be facing? Sentinel Gladiator Kaiju will appear. All right, now Gladiator sounds like a ground boy to me. So, uh, give me Juro. We have to fight. So we can trigger his brain overload and then maybe a first gen as well. This will let me have, if there are flyers, Goto and kind of Kisaragi can deal with them. Juro is probably going to be Plasmark Fusion Cutter Man when it comes to uh, these gladiators because that sounds terrifying. And then I guess do I want Sekigahara or Ogata? Fine. Ogata really popped off last mission, Let's truth go. be told. Like, I'm not gonna lie, his his hyper condenser is pretty fucking sick. Are there any cool anything cool I can get for you? You just have multi lock missiles, but for the ground, I wasn't that big of a fan of it. Force cooling device is pretty good though. Wait, we should okay. Goto, what what do you need to become better? Like. Maybe like gravity missiles? I remember really liking those. Having shield matrix on him would also be pretty nice. Hmm. I'm not a big fan of flare torpedo. I did really like the convergent lasers. I don't know, what, what do we got for Kisaragi? We have an empty slot for you. Let's get something for you. I mean, super large missile is pretty sick. I'm not gonna lie, I do really like super large missile. Missile rain is funny, I don't think it's super good. It just doesn't really do enough damage, right? Like, it's good for swarms, but I don't know, there haven't been a ton, there's been like that one swarm map, and even then I have my, uh, my meta system to deal with that. Anti-ground hunter missile is probably really good. We have that on Miura, I believe, and I really like it. It's ground kaiju ignores armor. Uh, so you have railgun, stunner, long range missiles, and the cannons. And then your hyper condenser just lets you, it gives you two railgun shots, that's right, okay. Um, Let's go with the anti-ground hunter missile for some targeted damage, right? Karabe, I'm pretty sure, is already decked out to the nines. If I upgrade this, the biggest problem with the Plasma Arc Fusion Cutter, A, it takes a gajillion MP, but it's kind of funny. Uh, but the bigger problem is how long you have to wait before you can act again afterwards, man. Like, you are stuck forever. So I'm curious, if I enhance it, does it reduce that? Let's find out. Okay, no, it just increases the... Oh, it does reduce the wait time a little bit. Just a smidge. Now, by power plus five, does that mean five total? Or is it gonna go to 225 times 50? Because five times 50 is a lot better than just five, right? It's also only 500. Okay, that's pretty, that's pretty good. That's pretty sick. Man, like 0.1 seconds though is kind of yikes. Can we upgrade anything on you? What does this give? Reduces the EP required, eh. EMP attractor has more lock on range. Oh, you also have anti-ground multi-lock missiles. Um, honestly, upgrading its demolisher blade seems pretty sick. Oh, and it gives it more attacks? Yo, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go like two of those, honestly. 
Maybe, maybe even more. Take me to like, yeah. Like, Ogata's Demolisher Blade is a, is real fucking good. Hisaragi. I might as well upgrade your railgun because you get two shots of them, right? So let's, let's give you some railgun upgrades. Um, Goto, we should upgrade your interceptors. Because again, oh, and he gets more interceptors. Yo. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, that's a big wait time reduction. Yeah, yeah, give me, give me more interceptors. So now he gets what? Six plus four, he gets 10 of them, right? That's insane. That's really fucking good. Multi-lock missiles, numbers fired. Lock on range and AOE. I just, man, gravity missiles. Gravity missiles are pretty sick. I don't think Goto needs leg spike. I don't know if it's really what like his vibe is. You know what I mean? At least not necessarily in what we're doing here. I've kind of got him set up as more of like a supporty sort of thing, like a not not supporty like Amaguchi, right? But like he kind of sits in the back and you know, give, give, we're gonna get shield matrix, right? And we're gonna put it instead of leg spikes. Um, and I think I'm gonna give him arm mounted convergent lasers instead of multi lock missiles. I don't want Goto going into the fray, right? I want him to kind of hang back and like, you know, hang around the outskirts of the fight and chip away at prio targets and be able to help out. Ooh, I could give him, I, I bought shield matrix. I wanted to get gravity missile. Well, now Goto also has shield matrix. Um, so if I ever need that, I guess. And then our mounted convergent lasers is hella cheap. So sure, and do that instead of multi-lock missiles. Um, what does upgrading this give? More range, less weight, eh. I'm not, I'm not crazy on that. So, Karabe. Honestly, upgrading heavy knuckles seems like a pretty good idea. It, it does some work. The, this is, this is okay. I mean, we use the arm mounted machine cannons. Oh, and I see now you, there's like a certain amount of times it can be enhanced, right? Interesting, so there's not like the little bars up there for this one. Is it just, am I just blind? Can you upgrade heavy knuckles indefinitely? Weird. So if we if we go to if we go to Ogata then, right? And Demolisher Blade doesn't have that, but EMP and Tractor does. So I guess, yeah, there is a maximum eventually. Goto probably with Interceptors has it. No, Interceptors can go forever. Strange. Set up movement. That's cool. That's a cool upgrade. I like that. Um. Pulse lasers. So that's 40, that's 60 extra, 64 extra damage total. No, that's 114 extra total because of the additional shot as well. 114 versus 25 times four versus 100. So technically it's better to upgrade arm mounted pulse lasers. It's more bang for your buck. But this is concentrated. Gimme give gimme give this one. I like the concentrated fire. Uh is there anything else I want to upgrade on Ogata? Maybe rush attack, truthfully. Another attack is pretty good. Yeah, 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 yeah. Give me another hit on that. Lock on distance and range. Eh, whatever. I don't know if defense mode is really that like cracked up to be. What does limiter removal give? Hold on, do I have someone with limiter removal? I don't. Damn. I thought I had it on Takatoshi, but I guess I don't. Sekigahara? No. Power and lock-on range. I wonder if these get, like, cool upgrades when they hit their, like, maximum amount. Four more power and two more shots. What about the rocket launchers? What do we get from that? It's just distance and range, whatever. Jammer rocket launchers I'm not in love with. I might pick up, like... I don't know. It's not bad. I'll, I'll keep it as, as an option, right? I kind of want to see what happens if I get to the full... You know, I'm just going to do it. I got a bunch of chips. So now what? Arm-mounted piercing cannons armament has been unlocked. 
Oh, okay. So when you fully upgrade one of those, you get another version that I imagine will eventually be better. Yeah, it's one more weight. I'm gonna use the normal ones for now, but having AP version is interesting. Okay, that's pretty cool. Does he have any others? I mean, come on. We gotta get him the upgraded Plasma Arc Fusion Cutter. Elite Armament. Yo! <laughs> it deals extreme damage. I mean... I mean... Oh, and you don't even have to buy it. You just get it. That's so nice. I mean, come on. Like... You gotta be crazy if you think we're not gonna use the the superior version here, right? Like, like uh, you know, come on, it's the extreme one. <laughs> yeah, like, what if I had both? What if I what if I had both though? It costs five hundred. You know what? Keep it, keep it. I like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is perfect. All right, now we have options. <laughs> Why not just keep both, you know, when in doubt? Um, okay, this opens a whole new world for me. So, EMP Attractor and Anti Ground. Uh, not really vibing with that. What about Goto? Ah, leg Spike, and his gravity missiles can be. We get a better gravity missiles. I think that's probably worth it. So, what do we get from this? Teleportation field! Oh, that's awesome! Allies in target area are teleported to you. You can get people out of trouble. That's incredible. Equip that. Fuck flare torpedo. Get teleportation field. Wait a minute. That's insane. Yo, I need to be doing this. Hold on. You're telling me Kisaragi doesn't get an upgraded railgun at some point? Bro. What the fuck? All right, so do we want to go with the Hunter Missile or the Long Range Missiles? Um, I think I want to go with the Hunter Missile. Lock on Distance and Range. It's actually the same for both. Uh, I think I use... And the Long Range Missiles just don't do that much damage. It's probably going to give me, like, an Armor Piercing version. I'm curious what the... what this is going to give, though. Look, we are spending, all right. High performance charger. EP recovery time reduced and recovery amount increased while defending. 60%, damn. Only six seconds. I mean, you, I never defend with you though, but it could, it could be a good idea. I don't know what I'd get rid of. I kind of like everything she has, truth be told. We'll think on that. In this mission, I don't want people defending. Um because we only have four guys, right? So that's a little spooky. Better EMP attractor. What does everyone else get? What is Takatoshi can get a better demolisher blade and leap attack. Sekikahara gets a better rush attack and also the missiles. Yori, Yori can also get the elite fusion cutter. That's pretty cool. Anti-ground piercing rocket launchers, okay. Heavy Railgun and the Rapid Cannons. Mira gets the Anti-Air Bombardment and the EMP Stunner. Two things I haven't even unlocked for him. Yakushiji gets better multi-lock missiles. I didn't expect that. And then her normal attack. Leg Spike checks out. Shield Matrix is a weird one. Amaguchi gets multi-lock missiles. Shield Repair. Okay. Um, I think I'm good. I'll save the rest of my... Yeah, I want to I wanna check. Is there anything else I could get? With meta system, another use would be pretty good. Yeah, give me four uses. Just give me four uses. I want to be able to blast out meta skills as I need them. Okay. I'm just going to double check bonus objectives again. Maximum four. We have Ogata, Karabe, Isaragi, Goto. Four out of six. Goto is on the strike team. Goto, right there. Clear without being immobilized. We got to do it when we're in there. Let's go. Put me in. Boss battle, baby. I feel a lot stronger now. Now that I've learned about these upgrades, uh, I feel much better. Dymo signatures, look there. Warning, Dymo signatures approaching. Preparing to intercept. Initiating 
the hell are those the gladiators? Are they flyers? That's a problem. Are those sentinels? Oh! Hey, yo. They look like first gen models, but they're giving off Dymo signatures. That's a problem. Most likely, they're the first generation units we lost in the battle at Sector 2. So they were seized and repurposed? Repurposed? Well, it may be more accurate to say they were reset. When we attempted to deploy automated sentinels, they behaved as if they were Dymos. During the battle at Sector 2, units 1 to 11 were being remotely controlled by me. You piloted 11 units by yourself? At the same time? That's pretty impressive. It wasn't efficient. <laughs> the defaults yeah. were clearly influencing their processes and abilities. And that's why we directly control them now. Too many problems with automation. I thought they were destroyed in that battle. I don't know if it's that simple. Juro, what do you mean by that? Look, they're coming. They seem like pretty heavy units. And they've even got the composite ceramic armor. Hey, that's fucked up. That's my so thing. Close quarters Dymos frontliners now. If we don't shut them down, the terminal won't last. An enemy sentinel. Okay, gladiators are the sentinels. 300 or lower, deal attacks to deal high damage with each blow. Okay, got it. They've got the thing that I've been abusing most of the game. I have to kill seven of them. Okay, you know, just defeat, se defeat all seven gladiators. What's the problem? What's the issue, right? No big deal. Kill the gladiators, idiot. Um, so this is a problem because like, for example, I don't think his demolisher blade does any damage because it does a lot of little hits, right? So like rush attack. Interesting, okay. Well, let's start with the easy shit, right? Like, I mean, we just want to absolutely blast this homeboy here. I wonder how much this is gonna do. What now? Okay, well it's it's incoming. Hopefully it doesn't like miss. I thought it would attack it instantly, and it uh, did not. Uh, get the interceptors out. They're not going to do any damage to the uh, the gladiators, but what they will do is help deal with the little guys. And also we have like a trillion of them, so that's pretty cool. I think I'm fine with where Juro is. I kind of want him to just. I we can't chip damage him though. Hmm. Could have him go in and just start punching one of them, but I'm not sure if that's a wise idea. I could just have him go. He can't even fusion cutter it because it won't do any damage. Oh my god. This is horrible. This is terrible. Truly. Uh. Just, uh. Hmm. It's a real thinker, isn't it? It's a real, it's a real thinker. There are some rocket launchers out to deal with the little guys, and we'll deal with the sentinels when they get closer, all right? We'll, we'll, we'll deal with that in a, in a moment. Uh, Ogata. Uh, man. Ogata, you're going to hold on for a moment. Okay, so the hunter missile did a ton of damage. That was like half his health. That's pretty sick. Those boys, those boys are coming. Um, they are en route, and let me tell you, brother, they are not happy. No, please, Pathing, I beg you. I want to go back here, so I want to go this way to get the back attack, right? Still no back attack from even there? My guy. My dude. They ought to be used to hmm. fight by now. We'll wait a mo yeah, another right. moment. He what just now? hit all the fucking... Wait, no, what did he take a bunch of damage from? No, he didn't take any damage. That's the little guy there. I thought that was his health bar, the one on the little guy there. Okay, okay. Um, Ogata, you're gonna rush attack the sentinel that is right here. These things are gonna fuck me up, dude. Let's do this. Take it. Damn. Oh. oh. <laughs> hmm. This is, uh, they are, they are in. They are in and they are ready to party, brother. Uh, 
Dear Ogata, I really need you to kill this guy, like really badly. Thank you. Beautiful. These guys are spooky. Goto. What's the range on this? Oh my God, it's massive. It's also like pretty much the whole damn map. That's pretty cool. Uh, this won't hurt the the Sentinels. I don't think Goto has anything that will hurt them, truthfully. So I guess he's gonna focus on, I wonder if they can get gravity missiled. Hold on, what if we try that? You know, a little test here, right? We, we drop a gravity missile here. Kisaragi's turn is almost coming up. Locked on. They can indeed be gravity missiled. That's good. That's good. Um, I mean, I think we just get Juro in there to start start punching, my dude. Just start beating the shit out of him. Uh, I'm not thrilled with that pathing, truth be told. Yeah, this is the pathing I want for the back attack. Now we're talking. Just watch. Decent damage. We need the hunter missile. Do we have any any more coming in? Not yet. Okay, we gotta deal with these boys before they start. Oh god. Technically this should hit, maybe. I'm afraid it's gonna miss, but we'll see. All we can do is hope. I could have Ogata. Hmm. Oh, wait a second. Okay, the missile hit. That's what matters. Ogata, you got a rush attack. The Sentinel. The Interceptor should be able to deal with the, the little fucks pretty easily, assuming they're smart enough to attack them. That's my only concern, is that they they just go for other shit. Dude. That's pretty sick. We're, uh... Hmm. Please be able to reach. I don't think this will kill without the back attack. Oh, and Ogata's gonna take a ton of damage. Can I get a better angle if I go this way, maybe? No, that's like the best it's gonna get. Well, we do what we can. That hit. How's that? Oh, and then it knocked him around. Thank God. You know, I wonder, does armor piercing actually and still get ignored by the composite ceramic armor. Let's find out. Good. Yeah. How many down? It does indeed still work it. that way. Uh, good to know. Good to know. Okay. Man, I chose a very Let's poor team for this. Let me tell you. Take it. That all you Confirm got? termination of Gladiator Dymo signature. Ooh, only five more. <laughs> There's only five enemy sentinels left. Warning: Dymo signatures approaching. Enemy in range. Okay, Preparing only one. Initiating tactical analysis. We can't afford to hold anything back. I'm trying, Don't brother. Try to take them down by yourself. Stay in close formation and rely on your allies. Okay. Hmm. Oh, and action everyone gets their action. Like That's so sick. Pause. Yo. Okay, I think. Oh God, that's disgusting. I don't like this. I can use these guys to bop into him though. Maybe, I can try. Um. Goto, my man. I, I gotta clear up all this shit here, right? Like just get, get this out of my face. You're gonna throw some more. Uh, well, you're not gonna do that because you've got no uh, EP. So instead, what you're gonna do is you're gonna shoot at some of these flyers and uh, hopefully get some EP at some point. Let's do this. Was that okay? Oh, I guess that did it. Hmm. So we got two shield boys here that they gotta go. So let's start with this one. Dude, the, the heavy knuckles is pretty, pretty fucking sick. Not gonna lie. Uh, the G molars are gonna be a real issue. Actually, no, they won't. They won't be an issue. They're not sentinels. I can just fucking demolisher blade these guys. Wait a minute. Yeah, like, let's just do like this. 
Yeah, now we're talking. I forgot. I was like, hold on. All of my. Oh, Karabi. Warning. Dymo signatures approaching. Enemy in range. Hey, uh, let me. Okay, they, we got another one. We have three more on the way. Three more? What do I do? This is an EMP moment, Um, is what this is. They ought to be used to fights by now. And then you my man you should be able to slip around here and hopefully punch all these guys away that are trying to blow up that would be really cool of you and i would i would very much appreciate it if you would knock these guys into the stratosphere if i could knock them into the guys up there that'd be cool that would be pretty sick yeah something like this right Okay, okay. How's everything looking? All right, nobody, we just need people to not be immobilized. That's the, that's the goal here. All right, so keep people alive. I need Karabe to go fucking start bopping this guy. That's it. That hit. How's that? God, that's so little damage. Oh my God, it's a nightmare. Knights of Mare. Are you in this little field? No, you're not. You're fine. Uh, I guess just kind of chip away at some of these guys. I don't know. Fuck it, dude. How's this? Goto, not really doing Go a ton ahead. for us right now, truth Thank be you, told. But you know what he is doing? His best, and I appreciate that. Ogata. We're gonna need you to come help deal with the guy up here at some point. What the fuck are you attacking? Oh, they're probably attacking the interceptors. Which there's still a couple of them left. That's pretty that's pretty good. Um Ogata, I want you to move no, for tech. now. Uh you still don't have enough EP for a anti-ground hunter missile, which is a real problem. Man, getting that weight upgrade would have been really good, huh? Would have been real good now. Right about now, huh? Bro, I am not prepared for more of them. Oh my god. That should be all of them. Everyone, keep at it. <laughs> I haven't killed any of them. Where'd they come from? They're in my way. No point ever thinking. Uh, brother, I haven't even dealt with these guys yet. What do you mean? Oh my god, this is such a bad team for this. Huh. Hmm. Well, <laughs> um, you know, it's a real interesting uh, predicament we're in here. Um, I don't know what to do. Uh, I guess we go defense mode and pray. That seems like a solid option. Yeah. I'm right here. And then, uh, what do I do? just start punching. <laughs> I guess. Here comes the pain. Yeah. Little by little. <laughs> how do you how do you get out of a? You know, this is this is another EMP moment. Just look, we got a bunch of these. We're gonna start spending them. Uh, how do you how do you get yourself out of a jail cell made of cake? One bite at a time, brother. One bite at a time. That's the motto we're living by right now. Cause whoo boy. Back attack? Yeah, there we go. God, it's so little damage. Gotta think. Well, Juro, uh, just do your best, best brother. Oh my god. Stay on guard. Hmm. Next move. Oh lord. Uh we gotta get that guy out of here. You gotta go. That didn't kill. Tragic. That's my win. They ought to be used to fight 
by now. Oh, ooh, ooh, what's that guy doing up there? Wait a minute. Um, that's a problem. Hey, yo. Hmm. Can we uh, get a little back attack angle here, please? Thank you. This isn't so hard, huh? Are you sure about this, Kisaragi? This seems pretty fucking hard to me, you know? I'm just saying. Little, little rough. <laughs> Maybe you speak for yourself. That guy's... I could just kill him. And yeah, just just kill. Just kill. When in doubt, just just kill. That's one less, all right? That's one less we gotta worry about, all right? Just just keep, keep, keep moving. Four to go, man. Okay. Oh my God, just four to go, by the way. Not a big deal, truth be told. Uh, huh. That, hit, got it. that was some really good what damage now? there, though. Okay, Ogata. I need you to take out these fucking guys, all right? Like, these guys are a real problem. The shield boy is also a real problem. Do you only hit it's something like this? Come on. Take it. That was really good. That was that really good, good, Ogata. I like that a lot. Thank you. Little shit. Hmm. Hmm. That guy's almost dead. Juro should be able to deal with him. We have two more EMPs. Uh, is now the time? What else do we have? I might want to save it. I'll try. It's all I ask, brother. I, it's all I want from you is for you to try. Uh, cause, oh boy. Uh, fuck. I guess you just start working on the guy that's right by you, huh? Here comes the pain. Get pretty good, pretty good. Here's the plan. Goto, you gotta get out of there, brother. There's an angry man right next to you, let me tell ya. And he is very upset. Juro should be able to kill him, though, in theory. Uh, I wanna get both of these guys, but... I think I think we move you, like, there-ish, right? To be able to do that. Good movement. Always think ahead, huh? Yeah, um... That was apparently a very good decision because, oh brother, we're in we're in hell now. Um, hmm. Get the get the damn flyers out of here, right? Juro's turn should come up now. That's that. What now? Oh, that attack went off, which is unfortunate. But Juro can kill one of them, so that'll put us down to three. This has to kill, right? Like, there's no way it doesn't. Oh my god, tragedy. Get him out of here. Push him back. Get him out. I don't want to think about him anymore. This isn't so hard. Uh, yeah, <laughs> this isn't so hard. The railgun is actually really good here also. Hold on, because we get two of them, right? Yeah, just like, get these, get these boys out of here. Hold on. Okay, we got another one. Confirmed termination of Gladiator Daimo's signature. Three more. Just three more. Don't let your guard down. Ooh, we are, we are working for this one. Used to fight by now. So we've got one here, one here, and then there's one guy all the way down here. All right, we'll deal with him eventually. He is a very low priority target as, as things stand right now. Um, The guy up there is more hurt, so we're going to try and go for him, right? Oh, it's like, it's just, it takes so much work to get him out of here. Thankfully, Ogata gets so many moves, like, otherwise this would be a fucking nightmare. I want to get the back attack, but I don't want to push him out of Karabe's range. So I'm going to push him back this way, right? Damn, that's some damage. Uh, you're not allowed to summon more guys. That's, like, highly illegal. Very illegal move. Not, not okay. Yeah, 
you know what? Shoot down all these missiles. Wait a minute. Just like shoot all that shit out of the air. I don't want to deal with that anymore. That easy. Okay. All right, this should kill. Hopefully. I said that last time and then it didn't and I was very sad. It killed. Perfect. Beautiful. Two more. We're getting there. Shinonome, you're not even on the battlefield right now. <laughs> I don't want to hear it from you. I'm out here. I'm out here fighting for my damn life, girl. <laughs> this should do a lot to that guy, but then Kisaragi is pretty much spent. Uh, the terminal is not looking great, truth be told. But it could be worse. It could be worse. Oh, Lord. I did not see these boys. Um... That's a problem. I don't know if Ogata will get another turn before they flash onto him and blow up. Uh, that's a real, that's a real thinker, isn't it? Do some movement for now, right? Do a little movement. Number 10, moving out. No, I'll try. Okay, well now, now you gotta knock him away from Karabe. Otherwise, he perishes. Can you knock them into the other gladiators? That'd be pretty cool. Like, kind of like this direction. Let's do this. Yeah. yeah, let's go. That was perfect. Kind of oh, no, I didn't see he took. Fuck. God damn it. Ready to give up then? He got immobilized. Apologies, Professor, but this game's not over yet. Thank what can I do? Oh, fuck. Um, we got an EMP. We have to. Got what now? Uh, someone else is going to have to deal with that stuff. Juro has to attack these guys. He's one of the two guys that can do actual damage to these motherfuckers. How's that? That hit. Now then. Oh, he's not immobilized yet. Okay, perfect. Um... Or, well, no, he is immobilized. He can't move. But he can still act. Why can't you move? I guess because he's immobilized, I guess. Um, that would make a lot of sense, wouldn't it? Um, hmm. Man, if only uh, he could, like, teleport out. <laughs> if only that's how that worked, huh? Um, I guess just shoot the guys in front of you? I don't know, man. Didn't even kill anyone. Kind of oh, tragic. You should be able to kill this gladiator, Ogata. Even without the back attack, in theory, this should kill, right? You get five hits. Oh my god, he's living by like a smidge. Uh, we can't allow missiles to exist because they might kill Goto. So. I think this move looks something like this, even though it's a little whack. Oh, that boy's now. jumping. I don't like that. Um, can I punch him mid-jump? I think I can. Yeah, get out of here. Just swat him out of there. <laughs> Jump up and slap him out of the sky. Like you're blocking a slam dunk. <laughs> Okay, uh, we have no more meta skills, which is horrifying. The last boy is all the way down here, though. So if Juro takes a beating, he's a tanky man. All right, he'll be fine. He's going to do great. Just, like, keep that guy far away from Goto. Um, far, far away from Goto. There is no way you can make it all the way down here in one move. Yes, yeah, so you got you to gotta do some actual movement. Probably to around, like, here-ish. Uh, yeah, yeah. What's Look, we're not we're not S ranking this one. All right, we all we all knew it uh, based on how this was going. There's no surprise there. How's this? Please just that kill easy. them. Thank you. That's my win. You'll pay. No this way. So hard. Okay. All right, it's just the gladiator left. Score. Got him. Okay. 
They're honestly, our boys down here, we're doing great. All right, you two are doing so well, and I'm so proud of you. I'm so very proud of you. They're like any other punks. And get another back attack, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. And keep them, keep them going at an angle away from the terminal. Let's go! Woo! Not an S rank, okay. We'll come back and S rank that one another day. That was rough. I've learned a heavy lesson. Uh, bring attacks that do a lot of damage in one hit. Because, oh boy. Unfortunately, it looks like I was right. Those weren't captured sentinels. Yeah, they make them now. Yeah, of course. ID codes were all three digits. They were newly created as Dimos units. They were the same type as the number 12 I pilot. Edison was the one who put the first gens together. I just helped out. The auxiliary stuff was from my design, like the EMPs and the anti-air flares. But these things were never meant to have a direct pilot. The original spec had them all automated. Explains why the enemy got a hold of them. That also means it's got a more unstable connection to its pilot. We had to put a limiter on its functions. Mm. So its true power is being restrained? What would happen if that limiter came off? You'll get a huge boost in maneuverability, but it'll put an incredible strain on the pilot, too. We have that. It's the, the limiter removal. For new power, and nothing a true son of Japan can't handle. <laughs> Sounds like it might have its advantages anyway. I'll have to let Sekigahara and Ogata know. I guess we did it. Oh, I guess we did it indeed, because who, baby, was it not elegant, but we got there. A lot of damage. Um... I think Goto really is technically immobilized, so I think we fucked that up. Good experience, though. Let's go. Bro, Ogata, damn. Element of surprise. Hey, look, score's not gonna be good. We all know it. Let's just be real here. 40%, 60, yeah. Yeah, all right, yeah, that's fair. That's fair, and then, yeah, I know. I know. Oh, did, technically I did. Oh, okay. He only got really hurt. He wasn't immobilized. Let's go. Beautiful. We at least got the bonus objectives. Okay. Woo, uh, do not proceed to the next wave because this is where we're ending the episode. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, as always, if you look down in the description, you'll find a link to the official store page where you can pick up and check out the game for yourself and do a lot better at destruction battles than me because uh, I'm dumb. <laughs> Learned a lot there. But yeah, if you've made it this far with me, I uh, really, really do appreciate you being here. And I hope you have a great rest of your day or your night or whatever time it is for you. And I will see you again next time. Good bye.